The impression that that made on me was so strong, and the story that you told about the idea of, of uh, taking it with you and really doing it, um, by coincidence, a few oh, weeks after we had our lunch, I got a call from the movie producer Linda Obst, who uh, did flash dance and contact. She's a very famous producer. I went to school with her. And she said, do you have any ideas for me? You know, she used to call me up every couple of years. And usually I said, no, I don't have any ideas. I can't think of anything. Gee, you know. But uh, at this point, I, I, I f at first said, no, I don't have any ideas. And I said, wait a minute, wait a minute. I have an idea. It's not my idea. But it's a great idea. And I told her about you and about, you know, hiding the, the treasure and uh, taking it with you and everything. Oh, she loved that. And so I made up a whole story around it, not with you as a character, but with an invented character. That's where you got the codex. Exactly. That's Good. it. That, that's where my book came from. Excellent. And sold the uh, movie rights to her. But before I sold them to her, you remember I called you up. And I said, Forrest, you know, I've got a, a movie producer who wants to make a movie, and they're going to pay some money for this. And so, you know, what do you think? And, and you said, Doug, in your very generous way, you've always, you're one of the most generous people I've ever met, said, I hope you make a million dollars on it. The idea is yours. Run with it. And so I did. And unfortunately, they never made the movie. Um, that's Hollywood, you know. But I wrote a, a novel about it called The Codex, which uh, I think is one of the best novels I've written. Well, what you may not know is that when I thought I was going to die, uh, I wanted my story to be told. I wanted some, uh, and I said in my book, I, I wrote my unauthorized autobiography mm -hmm. because I didn't know where it was going to go. But, but since I figured I was going to be dead at the end, I couldn't write the book. That's why I wanted you to write the book because my, my bones were going to be right there by that treasure chest yeah. and I was going to do it my way. Yeah. But, but uh, uh, Doug didn't want to write that book. I think he was afraid of it killed me or something. <laughs> well, it, it, there's a superstitious fear there, but, but uh, I have to say the book you wrote, The Thrill of the Chase, is an absolutely fantastic oh, book. Oh, thank you. And thank you. You, know, you sold uh, thousands of copies, so I guess a lot of people think so. You know. So, Forrest, who are you and who do people think you are? I hope nobody ever finds out. Ah. We're all charlatans to some degree, you know, We about ourselves, you know. I've, I've, I thought one time that women are, are fakes themselves. They wear lipstick and, and mascara. They, they're misrepresenting the product.